Good morning, and welcome back to another zoo vlog. It's a beautiful day today, about 75 degrees. And here I found this yellow-backed diker grooming himself. They're a very elusive antelope. I think relative of the dictic. And you can see why they're called yellow-backed dikers, because there's a yellow stripe right on their dorsal section. And they got these little horns and this bizarre looking nose. They look rather cute. Looks like Chico's really enjoying that alfalfa. Or is it Timothy? But look at those tusks. <laughs> Man, you are, you are beautiful. I don't know why people would call you ugly. Just look at those tusks you have. Oh, uh, you silly piggy. Or, or perhaps I should say Mr. Pig. Bontebox have their turn out on the veldt again today. And as usual, the male is always following the female. It looks like it looks like he's trying to get a scent of her urine for whenever she does urinate to check to check to see if she is going through estrus her estrus cycle. Oh, nope, she's running. You know, it's really hard to believe that only a week ago it was 39 degrees and now it's a nice 75. It's really pretty. Really comfortable. I remember how these things weren't on for the longest time and now they actually got it to work again. These little rock cop G cop how do you pronounce them? The the cap copy. Uh copy copy fountains. Copy rock fountains. Yeah. Makes it look very pretty. And there's a little lizard right there. Hey, little reptilian friend. Some nice flowers in bloom.
these lily pads will get bigger once the seasons get warmer. And it sounds like the bonobos are excited about something. Yeah. Let's go see. Looks like they might just be socializing with some of the guests, maybe. Or just making a a call to one another. There's a little 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 baby right there. These two are playing. Today was quite an interesting day, but being that my camera's about to run out of battery, I might as well sign off for now and focus on these hogs rummaging around in the mud. Looks like they're just playing around with the muddy water. Those little biggies. Alright, so I got a little bit noisy at the warthogs, so I decided to come over here by the aviary 
and to give my final sign off while focusing on a African spoonbill that have very striking blue eyes. So yeah, thanks for watching this zoo vlog and I'll see you all in the next one next Wednesday. Excuse me, Mr. Squirrel. That's not your food. You'll become an overbeloated squirrel if you keep eating bird food. Right. Also, why do these white storks look pink in coloration? They're not known as pink storks, they're known as white storks. Huh. Strange.